you change the past and you change the future it's a new universe let's go this is the most beautiful thing i've ever seen in my life You might as well call Annie Masha a plantation owner and call me a slave because I am ready to serve my master. Call me Django Samuel Jackson because every piece of footage that we receive as a fan base is absolutely glorious. It just looks like a live action comic book brought to life. Please, James Gunn, and I know you will, and I know you're a smart man. You will hire this man for the next Batman Brave and the Bold in a possible Justice League film that you have on your schedule right now. I mean, uh, what do you want me to say, bro? What do you want me to say? I am tired of giving this movie oral, all right? I'm tired of it. My throat is a little parched. I would like a glass of water, please. So let's break this bitch down. First of all, this flash suit, more and more... It's just glorious. It, 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 it's my second favorite Flash suit of all time. I love the way it looks. That cowl, it just, uh, like, like some, some, the, like, the certain angles looks amazing, and then certain angles, I'm just like, <laughs> it, it's frustrating. It's a frustrating cowl to see. But here it goes, my baby. My baby Sasha Kaya, bro, just looks awesome. Just looks majestic. Like the way she lands, superhero landing. Ryan Reynolds will be proud. She just looks amazing. She looks glorious. We got an old ass Michael Keaton trying to stand up slowly. He's 75 years old. Give him a break. But even he looks cool, bro. And of course, Batfleck. Like, we, we're like seeing all the footage from Batfleck, by the way. <laughs> so, but who cares? It's Batfleck, the man with the golden chin, the golden cock. He looks glorious as well. And it's just a shame that he won't be back playing Batman. But hey, we're getting him in this movie. So I'm not going to complain about it. I'm not going to bitch about it at all. Again, every frame looks beautiful. This shot right here of Sasha K -K 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 Kaya looks amazing. Michael Keaton looks great as always. Looking majestic. Look at that shot. Look at that shot. Oh, so good. So good. I like, I, I, I have no words. There are no words for this. And of course, the classic homage to the Batman 89, the Batwing. The Batwing flying through. I'm, I'm guessing that this is the big climactic battle with, with the Kryptonians, the Flash. But I, I did hear that this is part of the first act of the movie that this is not even the the, the conclusion of it so that's interesting and of course that perfect michael jackson slide in looking beautiful ah oh, man i am a simp for sasha guy bro and of course michael king is like let's go ah oh, love it love it love it love it of course all the logos just flash on the screen no pun intended pun intended indeed oh man it, it looks good it looks good bro <laughs> I don't know what you want me to say. I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying to like. I don't know why you want me to bash this because I, there's nothing to bash. Look at that frame. Oh, that looks. She she just embodies the 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 power of Supergirl. Please, 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 please let her be the Supergirl for of tomorrow. I, I love that shot. I love that shot. And the jets just flying past her. Here's Sasha with the heat vision. Of course, we've seen this in several trailers. It just looks awesome. It looks awesome. <laughs> there's, there's nothing for me to complain about this shit, bro. Oh, that's Michael Keaton. Michael Keaton does look cool here. He's like, let's go. I love that. Oh, oh, man. It looks good. It looks awesome. It looks peak. It looks peak. I, I'm, <laughs> there's nothing that that, that, that bothers me in, in this trailer, in this new footage. It, it, everything just looks, it looks cool. It looks, it looks cool. Like I said, this movie is going to be a big hit. It's going to be a big hit. And I mean, I'm glad that, you know, Ezra is going to leave the role with a big hit. And of course, some people are like, well, he's not going anywhere. Because if this movie makes a billion dollars, then he's not going to go anywhere. And I'm just like, listen, if this movie makes a billion dollars, it's not because of Ezra Miller. Put it that way. <laughs> like no one is going to see this movie because of Ezra Miller. They're going to see it because of Michael Keaton, because of the... Of just the the pure nostalgia of Michael Keaton being back as Batman. And the movie looks good. It looks epic. It looks like some fucking Lord of the Rings type shit. You know what I'm saying? So that's why they're going to see this movie. And that's why this movie is going to make a billion dollars. Not because of Ezra Miller. Ezra Miller is replaceable. Remember, the character will always be bigger than the actor. So, bye-bye Ezra Miller. <laughs> hey, you're leaving the role with a, with a giant hit on your head. So, good for you. But, uh, yeah. 
Hit like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Discord, all that bullshit. Let me know in the comments down below. This new footage looks peak. It looks awesome. Sell the damn tickets already because I am in it to win it. Love you all. Stay safe. Mwah. Big kiss. Uh, I ain't no bitch.